after this guy right here in this little Honda thing was racing me. I don't know, he just got it, I guess, because there's still the temp tax or registration, whatever. That was fucking weird. It was like, ring, 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 ring. you know that noise they make? Bitch, I'm in a four cylinder. I don't race nobody anymore. Gosh. But it looks like, um, if you guys have seen that movie Constantine, you know when, um, when, um, Constantine goes into hell, like to visit, and it's all like windy and like ashy and dusty everywhere. That's what I feel like it looks like. Like our apartment had it worse, but like, that's what I feel like it looks like right now. Like, like hell. <laughs> so, um, speaking of hell, me and Aaron are thinking of moving somewhere closer into town because um, this whole apartment thing to the west side was a really fun idea, but it's so far. Like it's way too far away. I mean, just not even just for like our work or whatever, but like our friends, like no one visits us anymore. Like if they do, it's like once every couple months just because of the drive. It's like 30, 45 minutes to get from downtown Albuquerque over to our house. So like I'm thinking we could get one of the most expensive apartments in Albuquerque and just live there. Like that's where I am now. This is Albuquerque. To me, this is Albuquerque, like around the UNM. I think it's actually called the student ghetto or whatever. But I'm still a student and like, it was sure would be nice to only have to work on the weekends and be able to go to study sessions. Like we have study sessions on Thursdays, but um, I work. I work Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, Sunday. If I could just work weekends, that would be awesome. Or if I could get a job that had like better hours and benefits, shoot. Praise God, praise God. You know what I mean. But, um, yeah, so, I don't know. Oh, we went out last night. It was so much. I'll start a new clip. So last night we went out um, to FX. That's our favorite place to go. I mean, hit or miss, it's always fun. Like, sometimes it's more fun than other times, but it's always fun. But anyway, um, so yeah, we went out last night. And we had so much fun. What is this lady doing? She got her some tools. But, um... I'm all nosy. I want to see if... Yeah, someone went to go help her. Okay, so, um... We went out and it was so busy. Like, last night it was St. Patrick's Day. St. Patrick's Night, I suppose. But, um, it was so much fun. Like, there was so many random people there. Lots of whiteies. Like, Albuquerque is not known for having white people, but they were all out celebrating. It was so awesome. Like, all kinds of straight guys were there, and they were cool. Like, it wasn't even like, oh, gay people, ah! It was like, cool, cool. Everyone's having a great time. Like, that's what I like. That's what I like to see. When just everyone just gets along and has fun. There was a scary thing. When we were walking in, there was security and the police in there. Last time this happened was at Lotus. And we didn't know the police was actually the fire sergeant and we had just paid our like fucking $10 cover to get in. Which I think if you're charging a cover, you better have some fucking bomb ass special drinks or something. Cause I mean, Vegas, you pay cover. That's just that. Because it's fucking awesome. You don't want to pay cover to get into some big room and just like look at each other, you know? But anyway, so we paid our little cover, whatever. And then, um, um, sorry, I'm trying to like, hold on, darn it. Let's see if I could do this. Here I am at work, just scan in, because I'm important. <gasps> oh, I almost hit one of them little yellow poles. Maybe I can't do this at the same time. So this is my parking structure. Everybody knows, I already made a video about this. But, um, so I work for the hospital and we all have to park in this parking structure because, um, well, there's the hospital. But it's like really on a busy spot, so there's not a lot of parking. I was trying to cut through those cars, but there's, I don't know, I don't want to do it. I'm scared. 
But anyway, <clears throat> so we went out, we had bunches of fun. We didn't see our normal buddies there, which was kind of weird because they kept saying, we're here, we're here. But we can always find them. I don't know. Maybe we're fighting. I didn't know, but maybe we're fighting. I didn't even think of that. But um, yeah, so I'm off to go to work now. I'm, I didn't even drink last night, which is really weird for me. Usually I have like one or two drinks every time. But last night I went out and the, oh my God. So that was some little, he was like five feet tall, right? It was this little thug. And like he was dancing all the fuck on Aaron. And Aaron's six foot, like six one almost. Like, we'll give him some hair, hair height. So like, oh man, like this little guy was grinding and I don't know, he was monkey dancing. Like it wasn't dancing I've ever seen, but I'm not one to judge. <laughs> and I say that with love and sincerity in my heart. Yeah, right. But oh my goodness, I don't even know what the fuck was going on with that little boy. Like, And I just, I just kept laughing, like, it was so funny to me, like, oh my god, this little guy, and like, grinding up on Aaron, and Aaron didn't even fucking notice. And this gross guy was behind me, like, trying to dance on me, and I could smell like he was fat. I could smell his obesity, and for a fat person to smell another fat person's obesity, that's pretty bad. God, I don't want my allergies to start acting up because of this fucking dirt everywhere! But I guess that's it for now, bitches. I love you all so much, and I hope you have an amazing day. Amazing Monday back to school for me. Enjoy the last free day of spring break, y'all. Okay, bye.